Welcome, Wolf of Wolfettes. We are back with a brilliant Far Cry 6 on the PlayStation 5. And I hope you guys and girls are having an absolutely fantastic day. Now, we got quite a few things done in the previous video. We finished spreading a bunch of propaganda for Radio Libertad for B-Show. We then spoke to Talia, and we got another mission where we needed to rescue a doctor. So we rescued the doctor. And then we also got another mission where Clara just wanted to have a chat with us in Esperanza. So we also did that. So we got quite a few things done in the previous video. But what we're going to be doing today is I think the only mission that we have available now is to speak to Bisho. And I think we are now going to start trying to set up the whole Radio Libertad so we can start spreading our propaganda through the airways to counter Castillo's propaganda. So let's get straight into things. But before we do that... Let's give Boom Boom a stroke because this good boy definitely, <laughs> definitely deserves a few strokes. He's been a good boy in these last two videos. He's been taking down a lot of soldiers for me. And not even with me having to ask him. He's just been a good boy. Okay, so let's have a look then. Uh, here we go. Track. And I think, um, I think B Show is home. Oh, and there's a flipping anti-aircraft gun in the area. Yeah, so this is, we're going to have to spend quite a bit of time travelling. Yeah, we can only walk. But I'm pretty sure um, uh, B-Show's house is up on the mountain anyway. So even if we could airdrop, I don't think we'd be able to get that close. Because we'd just end up smacking into a mountain. Oh, where is this? Over here. What do you know? Danny, marking an anti-aircraft cannon on your map. You know what to do. Gracias, gracias. That's probably the anti-aircraft gun I was just, uh... Yep. <laughs> Literally the one that was uh, causing me problems. I don't know if we should go and deal with that first. I can't remember what mission I get with B-Show. Like, I can't remember if it's like a long mission or anything like that. This is the uh, daily chest that you can open. We get quite a few goodies from that, to be honest. Right, I think what we're going to do... Can't really see shit at the moment. But I think what we're going to do is take down the anti aircraft gun, and then from there, we will go and speak to B Show. Looks like we can get a horse up here. Oh, hello, buddy. He's already waiting for me. You're right, mate. How you doing? Okay. So, Pony. What we're going to do is we are going to take down an anti aircraft gun, and then once that's done, Providing that you don't go missing or run away from all the explosions. You're then going to take me up the top of a man in and we are going to have a chat with B-Show and then I'll feed you some lovely carrots, maybe a few apples, maybe get you some hay and you can uh, retire from your mission. Okay, buddy? That's all we're going to be doing with you. Just a little, just a little, oh no, you don't like water, do you? Nope. Oh, hey, f all right, all right. Fucking hell, Dave, carry it. What was that all about? No need for that, no need for that. Don't worry. I'm a friend. Right, I don't think there's a way of getting across with you. We might have to already leave yeah. you behind. I was going to say, all you need to do is take me to an anti-aircraft gun, take me up a mountain, and then we're done. How about over here? Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, right, fuck you then. Right, fuck, stay here then. Stay here then. You was going to have some delicious carrots, some delicious apples, and some nice fresh hay. But now you can starve, you little git. <laughs> Fucking hell. Broke my back nearly. Twice. Okay. I need to get some sort of car. I think those might be important for a mission later, so remember the locations of them. I think it might be important. I'm not 100% sure. Nah, too slow. I was going to try and, try and blow that aeroplane out of the sky. Oh, we're nearly at the anti-aircraft gun anyway. I think... I think the map just makes things look further away than they actually are. Yeah. 
One thing we do need to do actually is uh, upgrade our Supremo with uh, new new consumables because um, the pipe bomb is very, very good. So I want to probably get that at some point. Don't you fucking hit boom boom! Fucking kick the dog. You don't kick the dog. No, you don't kick the fucking dog. How many times have I got to tell you? Like, you can shoot at me if you want, but don't kick my dog. Oh, that's a very old uh, video of that, innit? I can't remember what it was, but it was, uh, I think it's supposed to be some Indian guy or something, and he's, uh, he's uh, ringing someone up and he's talking about how someone kicked his dog. You're kicking away, dog! <laughs> That's a very old funny thing. Oh, but that was like on that fucking old website, I think. That Ebabum's e e World or whatever it's called. That very... I don't know. I think it must still exist. I'm not sure. I think it was on there I saw it. And this was like early 2000s, maybe even 90s. It's on my uncle's computer. I didn't have a computer. Too poor to have a computer back then, unfortunately. Okay. Oh, we're not in combat. What are you talking about? Because it loves to tell you you're in combat when you're not. Hey, look, I think I found a new horse. This could be Dave number two. Oh, no, never mind. He's, he's, too, he's, he's on the ground level. Never mind. Not going to faff around going down there. I think um, Boom are also Mark's animals as well, which is very nice. Especially if you're going to go hunting. Boom is a good one to bring with you. Because sometimes finding the animals is a pain, especially when you have to hunt at night. And you can't change the time of day in this Far Cry for some weird reason. So far, all we've done is take down an anti-aircraft gun. This is a flipping nightmare. How are you doing, boom boom? I don't think this piece of shit's gonna get us there any quicker to be honest. Oh no, it's, it's pretty pretty speedy. I swear that army truck just hit one of the soldiers on the horse, one of his own allies. Right, there we go, I'm making quite a bit of progress now. <laughs> they were a baddie, if you're wondering, they were a baddie. They're the ones that you can bribe with money to get information. Well, I got you a free car, Fisho. Yeah, give me those copyright claims. Woo! Yeah. Yeah, everyone likes a copyright claim. Oh, actually. Whilst I'm here. Okay. So, let's have a look. I'm going to change the dynamite. Oh, we don't have any industrial composites still. Okay, we can't then. I don't know why we ain't got none of them yet. I think you might get them a lot from the uh, mission boards. Pizza. Man, turn the music off, B-Show. You're going to be copyright claims. Welcome to Radio Libertad. Marquesa locked down the internet. So we're taking over the radio to give Libertal a voice. But Yara's old ass network is cock blocking me. It's from like, what, 1993? 
The red antenna tower things around here shoot out the signals, but most of them are broken or point the wrong way. I tagged all the broken shit, fix and rotate them. Por favor, for our dream, we're gonna give Yara the truth it needs. All right. Did I ever tell you I love you, Danny? All right. All right, mate. That's, uh, steady on. I've only known you for like one video, buddy. All right, keep it down. Relax. Looks like there's a couple of, uh, yeah, a couple of locations. Oh, look at that. He's got a bunch of steel in his back garden. Lovely. Looks like there's a weapon crate in his house as well. Where is it? Oh, there we go. Oh, very nice. A high fire. Sweet. Okay, right. So, we're going to fix the antennas so that we can bring Radio Libertad online. All right, then. Because the internet's been locked down by Maria, which makes perfect sense. Don't want people being able to access the uh, internet if you're trying to control them, because that is, you know, Let internet is a lot of freedom on the internet, isn't there? To, uh, you know, voice opinions and plan stuff together, like protests and all that shizzle. Yeah. Looks like there's a lot of bad guys around here. Okay, bicho. Those soldados are in my way. I see you, engineer. Did you just... Did you just whimper then, boom boom, or was that a bird? This is finally a sunrise. If you're wondering why I can walk so quick when I'm uh, sneaking, it's because I've got the dark tech boots on, I think they are. It's pretty much the same thing I've got on my chest. Uh, boom Boom just walks through the camp. There's the officer in charge. Move, boom, get them, boom, boom. Watch out, it's attacking! Okay. Oh! Boom, 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 over here. Did you say watch out, it's a Yankee? I mean, I, I, I don't know if the dog's a Yankee or not. <laughs> Who knows where he's from? Two more to go. Oh, we're done. I thought we had to actually climb up there and do some work. Oh, brilliant. Alright, which one's next? I think one of them we do have to climb up the radio tower. I remember climbing one. Or maybe I'm thinking of a different mission. I wonder if they're going to do that again in Horizon Forbidden West or if they're going to change it. You know, in Horizon Zero Dawn, you had to uh, climb up those tall necks, didn't you? And that was pretty much how you would reveal a chunk of the map. It was a very nice way of doing it. A lot of platforming. And plus, they moved around a lot, so you used to have to be patient and wait for the tall necks to like pass like a certain man in or something so you could climb the man in, then jump onto their heads and start doing a bunch of parkour to climb them. And then it would reveal a bunch of the map. It was like a creative way of just doing the generic, you know, scan the tower and reveal the map crap. But it was, it was a nice creative way of doing it. But I wonder if they're going to do that in Horizon Forbidden West or if they're going to change it a little bit. Guess we'll find out. Not too long till it releases, really. Like the middle of the middle of February, in it comes out a week before Elden Ring, which is a shame. I wish Elden Ring still come out in January because there's nothing in January now, and that pisses me off. Talk about us over. Okay, Bicho. What did you mark? <laughs> Bicho, 
I'm at the apartments. Oh, that place is wrestle well to the max. They steal from the grid to live. But one of their control panels is fried. It's calling off power to one of my antennas. Get on that roof and find it, por favor. Follow my blue graffiti to the control room up there. It's locked. But that never stopped you before, right? Never, bicho. Fuck ya! Yeah. Radio Libertad is gonna light up ya yeah, with truth! Alright, we need to get in. Where do we need to get in? I remember there being something we need to do here, like a little puzzle or something. Oh, power. Should check the wiring up there. Oh, yeah, I think what we need to do, I think we need to shoot this. From this window, I don't know if you have to do it from this window, but shoot that, that like water tank. I think you might not have to do that actually. That might be bullshit. But then we need to come round to this window here. No, I don't think you have to. No, you don't need to shoot that. But you've got to shoot this lock right here, and then you can open up the door. What the fuck's going on over there? Leave him alone, you wanker. There's the brick. I say you I say you repair anything, just pull out a blowtorch. Get a puncture on your bike. Esperanza. Blowtorch. Get ready for Radio Libertad. One more tower and Radio Libertad is born. You give me quite a lot of um, ammo. I don't really need it. We're not really seeing that many uh, bad guys to be honest. And then you have other missions where there's just absolute anarchy, but yet they don't give you anything. Okay, I don't know if we need to come up here or not. I don't think we're going to get many other missions done in this video. I think it's going to take a bit of time. Guerrillero, Maria Marquesa Productions is where Maria films all her propaganda. She treats her workers like shit. Go help them out. Thank you. What's the matter with you, Boom Boom? Flipping hell, mate. Oh, you might want to take over this place um, soon. Because I think there's a mission where you have to go there later and collect some sort of item. So if you've already taken over the place, then you can just pretty much go there and just collect the item. I think you need to get some sort of media pass or something for one of the important missions. So yeah, you might want to take, that, take over that place a bit sooner. We might do that maybe in the next video, if I remember. I mean, I'm recording this on a Thursday. I won't be recording on Friday because I'm busy and I don't generally record on Saturday and Sunday. So, yeah, I'm, I probably will forget. <laughs> what the fuck's going on? Oh, this might be the place, actually. Yeah, we don't want to fly into there, then. Hang on a minute. Door's knocked and my dog's going crazy. Bloody dog going crazy all the time. <laughs> I had to open it. A lot of deliveries at the moment because Christmas is coming, so things are being delivered, like presents and stuff like that. So you know, I had to open it this time. All right, one more tower. What are you hooting about? That better not be aimed at me, because you were nowhere near me. They're just those arseholes that love the sound of their hooter. You know those people that just love to bib all the time. Even when they know it's not your fault. Like when they know that a car is stalled or something Daddy, like that in the middle of the road. See, si, I'm near the tower by Cafe Taza. Por qué? You sound stressed. My buddy knows this guy who sells calling cars on the corner. And he said Marquesa cut off this other dude's balls for doing a mural without Ministry of Culture approval. Getting cold feet? I will no, Marquesa can fuck off. But if she comes to me, Danny, protect my bottles, okay? Uh, I can't promise I'm gonna protect your balls, to be honest. I can't promise it. Okay, Vichos Graffiti. Look at the state of this thing. This thing ain't even gonna function. I don't think we can even repair this bloody one. 
Look at all the flippy, like, something from The Last of Us. Look at all the moss on it. Or vines, I should say, not moss. Uh. Well, you're bloody done. What the flipping hell did you just do? I don't know what happened there. We've got all sorts of flipping uh, knotted up. <laughs> Controls to be at the top of the tower. Oh look, free hammer. Oh, be careful. I think there might be eagles around here. I mentioned this, I think, in the previous video. Good job they didn't see me. Oh, what happened? The flipping hell happened there? Danny, will you climb? Jesus, Danny, stop it. Not, 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 it's not the time to be faffing around. I mentioned this in one of the other videos that every time you go somewhere high, you get attacked, and I can already hear the little gits. Adios. <laughs> I can hear you. Where are you? That will boost the signal. Go time for Radio Libertad. Danny, try to broadcast, but I guess it's jamming my signals. Or I ain't even taking a headphone. Fucking 2G connection. So I had John present the AMT station. Fuck up the big dishes blocking signals. I am amplifiers on the tower. Amplifiers lights up the clock like crazy. Danny? Danny? Uh, can you? Can you hear me? Bicho! Hello? Ah, binga. Maria is blocking all transmissions from the Tanino Peak relay station. Oh, okay. Oh, it's relatively close. I thought we were done. You see that flipping eagle just dangling? <laughs> oh, I feel bad now. Well, I, think, I don't know if it was because there was a nest up there. It looked like we were standing in a nest. So no wonder they were attacking me. Probably just protecting their babies. And I went and shot one of them. Now I feel like a cock. <laughs> I feel like an absolute cock now. Stop fucking bibbing! Now you got a reason to bib. I'm alive. Horses. Horses have been such jerks to me in this video, haven't they? I don't know if there's a kid outside my house. I don't know, I think they're in the playground. I don't think it's not break time yet, because I make sure to record before break time happens. Even though during the bloody lockdown I had to deal with it every day because they was having two breaks. Thank God that don't happen no more. But I think uh, well, there's a kid out in the playground at the moment imita imitating fireworks by the sounds of it. <laughs> some fucking crazy kids in that school, I tell you. And some little scumbags. Officer. Not an officer anymore. Jammer's gotta go. Oh no! Uh, I thought I saw someone.
There's a sniper up there. Got eyes on an engineer. Saw that car coming. I don't know if that that was supposed to happen, but yeah, I made sure made sure I got in there quick. Oh, I think that might be someone that gets stuck under the ground. I think that happened off camera as well. I think there's a dude that gets stuck there under those stairs in the rocks. on the map. Oh shit, here we go. They're back. Oh god! Right, you're going to have to protect me, Bum Bum. There's the tower. Switch on the amplifier. Oh, hello. All school, but it's gold, bitch. Hey, Daniel's gonna love it. Paulo's gonna lose his shit. Did you tell Clara yet? No, because I'm talking to you. <laughs> Enjoy the moment, bitch. <laughs> Flipping hype, wasn't it? Oh, Talia gonna message me now? No. Okay. All right. Well, I'll go have to end the video now, Wolf Wolfets. So yeah. Thanks for watching, Wolf Wolfets. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Like, share, and join the pack today.